Okay, um, what's up guys? So, yes, I'm doing a video this late at night, um, in my bathroom, whatever. Um, in about six days, I will be, um, a year and a half on testosterone. And I just wanted to give kind of a little bit of an update on, um, uh, just kind of what's been going on, any changes, anything. Um, it's been really weird because, like, the first, um, year, the first, uh, like, six months to a year, um, i seen nothing but, like, changes. Like, um, they came fast, and now, like, since I've passed my year mark, it's, like, slow changes. I definitely hear my voice deeper, um definitely have um facial hair growing in that i keep shaving um hoping it grows back but um you know it's just been um <laughs> what else can i say about it it's just been a journey uh i guess this is right yeah i don't know maybe that worked um set against the candle there it's just been a journey i mean like have highs and lows and um yeah i mean it's I, i'm having slow progression um as it goes by but i mean it's going um and uh they say um or from what i've hear from a lot of other um guys on testosterone is that basically um you know after the first year or so you're gonna see a lot of gra like slow gradual changes like slowly slow progression and um i definitely say i see i see progression i see change i definitely see change um that's not at all like really an issue that i don't see change um it's not as fast as i'd want it to be but it's all part of the process um but i really wanted to talk about like uh for anybody struggling you know like me like i thought that oh if i just start hormones if i just start testosterone then everything else will be okay once i started hormones now it's like oh my god i gotta have top surgery gotta have top surgery gotta have it gotta have it gotta have it and um i don't have it yet i'm 25 i wanted it my goal was to have it by the time i was 25 and um my transitions everything to me um you know i chose my transition over everything and uh i would i would choose it over and over and over again um not having top surgery definitely very depressing definitely gives you um a lot of gender dysphoria or for me at least um but i know that i'll get there as long as i stay hopeful for that then i know it'll happen um the um, i mean i mean yeah there's nothing much new other than growing in facial hair voices getting deeper i do feel more confident in who i am um i love myself regardless that i have top that i don't have top surgery yet um, I do know that it'll come. I just kind of want, I'm like a kid. I want it like right now. Um, but I know I have to work for it. And I'm um, going through my own struggles as it is. And um, so, yeah, I guess just the point, is, the point of this video is to any guys out there who are pre transition, pre testosterone, um, don't be discouraged because it will happen. I used to think that I would never start testosterone now. I mean, on November 6th, it'll be. A year and a half that I've been on testosterone and um and I thought that would just be the like that would just solve all my problems but it, it really hasn't um because now it's like I have the, dis the gender dysphoria um of top surgery I really really just want my top surgery and then I'm thinking oh if I just have my top surgery everything will be fine um but with gender dysphoria it is an actual mental um uh disorder that people have um body dis even like people who have body body dys dysphoria everything um so we're always going to find something that gives us gender dysphoria or any type of body dysphoria 
Um, but I'm just learning to love myself even without the surgery yet. And um, it's been very hard. Um, I've lost motivation. I don't go to the gym and I used to love the gym, um, pick up a soccer ball. So these are, those are things that I'm trying to get back in my life. Um, it's just taking time. I know that I'll get there. It's just a matter of getting there and doing it. Um, so just everyone keep your head up. Eventually you'll start testosterone. You will get your top surgery. I remember guys telling me, you're going to start testosterone. You're going to start testosterone. And I never thought that I would. But here I am like a year and a half on it. Now it's just like, oh my God, I'm never going to get top surgery. And the guys, same thing. They're like, dude, you're going to get top surgery. It's going to happen. It's going to happen. Um, I just, my only regret is not transitioning sooner. I've known this for a very long time. Um, I first came out and started my transition two years ago. Um, yeah, like two years ago, um, two and a half, three years ago, I came out about being trans. Um, but I'm a tr proud trans male. Um, it doesn't just mean I go, hey, my name is Logan. I'm a transgender male, transition female to male. But um, I'm not afraid to be who I am. Um, and in this world, it is scary to be um, an openly out trans male. But I feel that if I didn't have those figures who made these videos or had those Instagrams or had those impacts that, you know, I don't know what I would have done because um, they helped me a lot. But anyway, keep your head up. You will start testosterone. You will get top surgery, bottom surgery if you want it. Um, if you have any questions, just comment below, um, follow my Instagram, um, it's L-O-G-G-A-N-C-O-N-E-E, -E, or it's L-O-G-A-N-C-O-N-E-E, -E. it's not one of those, but, um, feel free to comment below any questions and just keep your head up, guys, um, like I said, I never thought it would happen for me, but it is slowly, but surely, um, but it's definitely worth it the journey i've embraced the whole entire journey the good the bad how slow it's taken just everything and that's what you have to do is really just embrace it even pre-transition even pre-testosterone you know who you are you know yourself and no hormone no surgery no nothing can take that away from you from being a man or from being who you are um uh, but anyway, I love you all, and um, hopefully this video gives you a little bit of courage or comfort. Um, 